Perez is a, sometimes a surprise package, a dangerous thrower. And then other times can get rolled over. Yep, yeah, she makes mistakes, doesn't yeah. she? Yeah, she does. Peterson Pollard dominating the sleeves, needs to use that. Oops. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Shido uh, straight away, Peterson Pollard. Got to make sure you have the other hand on and then snatch it off and then go back on with both hands. Any kind of separation now and it's immediate. Strong that, that Kataguruma there, head underneath, drove, driving over to the side. Look at the drop. Not always the uh, direction you expect either. She was in there on the neck, Peterson Pollard. Needs to hook into that arm, I would have said. Trying now. Yeah, I mean, she hooks in and then takes it up towards the head there. Yeah, the right leg got just a little trapped. bit trapped up. Yeah. Dominating the sleeve here, Peterson Pollard needs to use it. Another chance to work on yeah. the ground. Not a well, lot happening, the referee decided, okay. Well, I think the more that Perez goes down onto her hands and knees there, the more Peterson Pollard needs to be on her all the time in Newaza. And, and to look that little bit more convincing. You know, you really need to show the referee I'm going to have get, a go, get involved. I'm going to get really involved, yeah. Say, okay, let me see what's happening. Do something. Let's see if he gives a little bit more time here. No, because he's, there, there, there's no, nothing happening. No, no, it's got to be positive, hasn't it? It has to be digging in there yeah. either for the neck or the busy. arm. And uh, not just busy, but positive and uh, directed and, and I just looked as though she was just blocking yeah and saying I'm okay here all right in that case let's get up absolutely bent over double these two Just about rotating in there, isn't she, uh, Perez? Second Shino up to Peterson Pollard. Uh, and, and it's because she hasn't put a, a full-blooded attack in. You get yours in. there with that as she was at. Good turn out there from Peterson Pollard. Really did well there, <laughs> didn't she? She did really well to get out of that. Good gymnastic ability without uh, using her head. I was thinking it was a little bit more like um, in diving. You know, one of those having like a double twist or something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, she needs to attack now, Peterson Pollard. She's only a couple of attacks away from receiving that third Shido. And that came off uh, the opposite shoulder here. I think one more, if not now, it's going to happen. Might give her a last throw of the dice. 
They, they want to see if there was a landing and any, any kind of control over here. Landed on the foot, so uh, I, I wouldn't think so. No, they've given it. So with half a minute left to go, that's how long she's got to pull things back. Paris can afford to, to run here. It's not going to be attractive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dive is going to pull a, a Shido, but she's still got one left. Two, actually. She's been very clever, Perez. She's come up with a score, kept the slate clean, which has meant that when things get a little bit difficult, you have to do some running. You can afford to take one or two shields. Yes, yeah, drifted away from Peterson Pollard. Perez then just blocking out now, and it's a, a gold medal then for uh, Federico Perez. The winner and Grand Prix Upper Austria champion in the under 70 kilo category in white Adobe, so, representing Puerto Rico, Maria Perez. Maria Perez of Puerto Rico.